right, welcome back to the channel, and this game was some bullshit. We're going to hop right back in it. Right here, first play, fumble, his lineman recovers it, plows forward for a first down. That should have been our ball right there. And then this is his game plan. He's just going to hit us over the middle with uh, Hardman or Tyreek. Right here, you see he gets us on a screen. We're going inside, looking for the middle, and touchdown. <laughs> okay. All right. So that's okay. 7 nothing is nothing to us. It's nothing. So here we go. Basic plays. We're just going to try to move the ball and, you know, score some points. But the game just won't let us do it. Here, I'm mashing the button to go to the tight end, and he's not throwing it. I don't say. Yo, tell me with this and you'll see this happen a lot, you know, where I'm just like trying to press the button and it's not working or whatever. Here we go. We hit a deep passing at the first down anyway, but the game really shouldn't be this hard. And so we're trying to score right here. I mean, I don't know. Uh, maybe I should have flowed that over the top, but I feel like he would have got there anyway. So I tried to hit him on the sideline and he ends up getting picked. So um, play action pass. We're not getting any kind of pressure with the Chargers. But it's all good. This should be a pick right here. He's throwing it up. That ball's in the air for a million years. Hits him right in the hands and he drops it. Cool. So he has to punt. We get the ball back anyway. And so we're just going to try to run the ball here. And, you know, at this point, this is a new team. I don't really trust my own line yet. So I went inside. I probably could have stayed outside. But here we go. Check this out. Like, where, where are you throwing that ball? Look how... He hits this is a rookie quarterback. I understand you're hitting the flats. This he's wide open. You overthrow him by 16 miles. Like, come on, bro. What are you doing? What are you doing to me? So here we go again. I'm mashing the button. He pump fakes when he's up getting sacked. I'm literally smashing the button to try to throw the ball. And he's not doing it. Maybe my control is broken. I really have no idea, but whatever. We get big sack, it's still seven nothing. And this is my bad. I'll take the I'll take the blame for this. I was trying to do press. I did over the top. I didn't shade outside. That's on me. Tyreek for a touchdown, obviously. So now we're down 14 nothing, which is a little bit more problematic playing the Chiefs. Our defense is kind of slow, but you know we're gonna try to get back into it. So here we go. Uh, throw a nice little dot right there. And we're just gonna try to move the ball down the field and get back in the game. So here we go. Woo! Nice little dot again. We're throwing lasers out here. And, you know, it's really annoying that one play he's throwing lasers, the next play he's overthrowing guys by a mile. Like, that's the frustrating part for me. So here we go. We're trying to run the ball, make keep it balanced. That's a little inside zone right there. Uh, you know, you got to run the ball to set up the pass. And here we go. Another dot. Another laser to the sideline. And so we're moving the ball pretty good. It's a nice little drive here. But wide open there. I possession caught it. I probably could have rat caught it and got it into the end zone, but I don't trust this game. I feel like he he might have I don't know he might have dropped it or something. So I just I just possession Woo! caught it and then we end up getting into the end zone anyway. Um. So yeah, there we go. Set fourteen seven. Close game, but the game just doesn't want us to win today. I feel like ever since they patched it in. February, the game's just been so broken. So many things are being weird. Uh, that should have been a pick right there, but that's okay. And, you know, I just think the whole game is so different now that with those two patches, I think they did some secret stuff to it. And, you know, but that's just me. So we get the ball back, 14-7. Look at this. Look how wide open he is. We're hitting him over the top, and he underthrows it by three yards, and that's a pick. Which shouldn't have been. He was so open. We're throwing it over the top. He short arms it somehow. And we end up getting turning the ball over. He gets a play action here. We get some pressure. Once again, throws it right over our heads. That's a safety out there, by the way. Look at this. He's throwing it right at us. This is a pick. Doesn't animate. He catches the ball. So they gave him seven points right there. Now it's 21-7. 20, and here we go. Uh, finally, we get a call because he's been doing that all game, pass interference. Uh, helps us move the ball here. And we have to settle for three. 
So here we go. We're kicking the field goal, and it's good. So we got 21-10, and we can still come back from this. It's still the first half, or it's still early in the third. So we can still come back and score some points, but we need some stops, which we don't get. Here we go. I'm looking for that um, hard man or Tyreek over the middle. He gets us with a um, – gets us sleeping in a pass defense. Look at this right again. He's throwing it right at us over the middle. My uh, my defender doesn't animate for the lurk, and he gets the catch. So there you go. That should have been another pick. Picks build momentum. Picks make people scared to throw, but we can't get them. So that's cool. Here we go once again, throwing right at us. Why is that not another pick? Throwing it right at us. He hits hands on the ball, drops it. You know? What do you do about that? When you're in perfect position, call the perfect play, and it still ends up being a drop. I don't know. Uh, you know, so that's that's taking points away from him. If we catch that, that's building momentum once again. But, you know, here we go. So he gets the ball. He tries to roll way out. And finally, we get pressure on him. We get the sack. But he still gets the field goal. 24-10. Game's starting to slip away from us here. And here we go. Once again. Uh, he undercuts the route. I'm throwing it to the far sideline. I don't think that I don't think that animation is realistic. I think uh, if you're coming from the outside, if you're coming from the inside going outside and I'm throwing it to the sideline, I don't think that uh, most nine times out of ten you're gonna pick that up. Later. But we give him the punt and it happens again. Okay. Am I gonna stop throwing that? Yo, Probably not. Man, this game is so goddamn bad, bro. Oh my gosh! I'm probably not going to stop throwing that because 99% of the time they catch that. 99% of the time they don't get there and they catch it. So here we go. Throwing hitting us with a slant. We're in man defense. Just trying to get anything. Trying to get a little bit of pressure. Don't mind me as I'm cooking while I'm talking to y'all. And he gets a touchdown. So at this point, you know, game's over. We're just trying to get something right here. And finally, we get an animation to go our way. That Moss animation. We fill up door set, and we get the catch. And so we think we're doing something. Oh, we get a face mask. So maybe we'll be able to throw up some points, get in the end zone here. And look at this. Everybody asks me why it takes me so long to call a play. I'm trying. I'm hitting the buttons, and it keeps zooming me out. So I got to zoom back in and hit the button again, zoom me out, hit the button again. So here we go. Cut inside. Hit stick fumble. Cool. See, they don't want us to win. Nope. Oh my gosh! So that's seven points taken away from us. Stolen from us. He gets the ball back. Game's over. It's over. But there's more BS to come. Watch this play. We got him. Look at our two outside guys coming inside. He runs right into them. There's two guys there. Oh, spins off of him, but we still got him for a safety, right? All we have to do is do the shoelace tackle. Nope. Trips over his own guy. Touchdown. Yep. Good job. Come on now. That's just that's ridiculous. And that's not even anybody special. That's not like he's an X-Factor player or anything like that. That's just a regular-ass dude. Like, and then look at that. Oh, my god! He got somebody wide open, overthrows him by a mile. Okay. So that's more points taken off the board. Really should be should be uh, 17 all if they didn't give him those points. But he's got 30. And the thing that frustrates me that I've talked about before is that, like, now people think they're good. Now people think that, like, they just dominated us. And when really what happened was you got all the animations, you got all the calls, and we didn't get any, which makes for an unbalanced game. You know what I mean? So here we go. Look at the guy in the slot wide open. We hit him. Think we're going to get something here? Nope. Because we got a penalty as soon as we snap the ball. Holding. Take it back. Oh, oh my gosh! What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do when I'm playing against the user and the programming? Like, come on. Come on, bro. And then watch this. Look how far this guy travels. Look how far he travels. And then look where he throws the ball. You should hit him over the top. I'm floating it. I'm throwing it up. 
He's got two y- two yards on him. If you lead him and throw it up, this guy has 95 throw power, by the way, quarterback. Under throws the ball by three yards is a pick. I'm like, okay, how does that happen? How does that happen? If you tell me, you're creating a game, you tell me if you throw a guy with 95 throw power, you know, he's going to complete it and he's going to be able to throw far. Why is he Why is he short-arming balls all the time? Like, this is ridiculous. The game was ridiculous. It was BS, but whatever. We got to make some trades here because we need some more uh, offensive firepower. But, uh, yeah, that's it. That's the ball game. That's GG. Thank you guys so much for watching uh, our new Charger series. Hopefully, next game we play, we won't get so much BS. Like, I don't mind losing. Like, I sound salty, but I don't mind losing. It, it irritates me when I lose, when I'm playing against the computer, when I'm playing against the programming and the user. Like, the same stuff happens on both sides of the wall, but he gets the animation and I don't. How does that work? I don't know. Anyway.